Hello again! So today's video is another Caveco unboxing. Yes, another one. I know they are pretty much all the same, but I always get excited whenever I get a new color and I just wanted to share. This is the chocolate brown and it came with a pack of caramel brown Caveco ink cartridges as well as a clip. I am thinking of switching the ink and maybe putting in writing desk or maybe even goose poupon. I think I'm even sold on putting in diamine tobacco sunburst since I have writing desk in my olive. And of course I have to line up a lot of the similar toned pens next to it. I'm really wishing that I could get that pretty like butterscotch looking one. I'm not really sure what the name of it is. It's either like coffee cream or it might even be an art sport, but I'm dying to get that color because it's just really beautiful. Uh, as far as the Caveco ink, I'm not a huge fan of this one. It's not really a caramel color. I don't know. It's, it's fine. I think I prefer writing desk as a brown ink, but I wanted to test it out. I do have Paradise Blue in my Lagoon Blue Quebeco and it just works so nicely. The nib itself is probably a truer fine nib than what some of my other Quebecos are. It's not terrible, but I do prefer a medium nib, and I do have a few fine nibs that are nice to write with, but I will always prefer a medium size nib, and I just wanted to do a compare and contrast. Here is my dark olive and it is filled with writing desk brown and it is a medium nib and it's just, you know, a thicker nib. And I just, for some reason, I've just always gravitated to medium size nibs. I've always, since I started collecting fountain pens, it's just what I prefer. And I don't know if it's the caramel brown ink that's making me not really like the way this one's writing. I think I will switch it out and see if it changes, but I'm not as impressed with this colored ink. It's nice, but it's just, it's not as nice as some of the other inks I already have. So I, I do plan on switching it out to possibly Tobacco Sunburst. I'm also impatiently awaiting an order from Ferris Wheel Press to arrive, but I don't believe it'll ship until the end of October, so I'm just gonna have to wait. But I do have two more inks coming from Ferris Wheel, and I'm excited to put those into pens. But anyway, here's a comparison to my other Caveco fountain pens with fine nibs that I have purchased from Amazon. Don't know if I mentioned that. I think my Midnight Green and L Lagoon Blue are definitely two of my favorite nibs that are fine nibs. And I also have the Rose Quartz, it's not currently inked up at the moment. I do think that Quebeco has improved on their nibs, so I feel like they're not as inconsistent as they used to be. And I would love to know what your favorite Quebeco color is. What color would you love to have? I think I've asked this before, but I'm also hoping to find a yellow, like a matte yellow. I know they have the frosted banana, but I would love like a mustard or something. I don't know. I don't care. I, I want all the pretty colors, but that's all I really wanted to share with you today. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you in the next one.